of what happened in that situation to help protect them. We've included training for our police officers to go to Georgetown Law School to participate in the bystandership liability through the ABLE program to get more transparency and accountability. I'm grateful for the opportunity to serve my city. I am leaving a career that I love to serve a city I love with no political aspirations beyond that. I believe in fighting for the people of this city and making sure that every resident in this city feels heard and feels that they have an opportunity to thrive in this city. I think it's really important for you to know that there's a difference, a big difference between me and Councilman Richardson. Councilman Richardson has spent his life in, public, in, in politics and I've spent my life in public service. And I'm here to serve you and I ask for your vote. Thank you. Well, first of all, thanks so much to everybody for coming out. I know it's an incredibly important election for everyone. And elections can be scary. Uh, but I have hope, and I'll, I'll tell you why I have hope. Uh, I have hope for my children, and it's bedtime, and we can't wait to take them home and put them in the bed. They've been troopers throughout this whole time. Um, I'll tell you, coming to the city, becoming a city employee, I don't know if that's called politics, but becoming a city employee when I was 26 was one of the best opportunities of my lifetime. Bought a house in this city when I was 25. You know, this is the city that allowed me to come here as a young man, right out of college. I was doing the body president of Cal State Biggs Hills. Get an apartment in Bixby Knowles for a one-bedroom apartment for 900 bucks a month. Married my wife at the Long Beach Museum, Museum of Art. Had my two daughters at Long Beach Memorial. Have a job as a chief of staff, like working on parks and learning policy at 26 at City Hall. Becoming a council member in honor of my lifetime to work hard and advocate for our community with families just like mine who want an opportunity. Serve as vice mayor of this city. You know, I never imagined that this was in the cards for me. But that's what's possible in the city of Long Beach. Now I'll tell you, I, you know, I'm optimistic about the future because I've seen what we've been able to do when we work together. I've worked hard to go from four, five neighborhood associations to 13 in the main district. Do things like participatory budgeting. People say we're crazy, but we help, we had our community help show us how to spend $300,000 two times on a needs assessment and improving our parks and making a real difference. I'm proud to try to take a smart data-driven approach to addressing the intelligence cities and the neck in our city by establishing an office of equity and leading in a very difficult time on the racial equity reconciliation initiative. I'm a proven leader that knows how to work together and bring people together to address our city's biggest challenges. When the homelessness was at our doorstep, we understood the assignment. We had been dealing with homelessness for quite a long time. We worked together, built the coalitions, the partnerships with the county to deliver the city's first municipal homeless shelter. That's inspired our whole city. Instead of knocking my backyard, every community saying, we'll do our part. That's the leadership that we need in our city, one that can bring us all together. That's how we unified our city in the primary, and won seven out of nine council districts. That's how we unified our coalition across town. Four out of five school board members endorsed my campaign for mayor. The majority of the city council college board. And I'm proud of Mayor Garcia. After a long time, it was a long time, he finally came on board and said, I'm voting for Rex Richardson for mayor because I know that he has what it takes. He's worked with us. He's worked with us both and understand what it takes to actually deliver results in our biggest challenges. Now, they, you know, campaigns are difficult and tough, but I know it will make it through. I know because I saw what we did after the unrest, whipping up glass and painting out graffiti. North Long Beach stepping up and fighting for libraries and parks. Across our city, we will overcome our greatest challenges. But if we work together. I'm Vice Mayor Rex Richardson. Thank you so much, and I ask for your vote. Take care.